deserve to make it to our wedding day. To me it's all about the Miracle families and the fact that they take the times out of their busy lives and say that we're inspiring that makes me push that much harder. Last year was my first year doing Nightgown and seeing the way that the kids interacted with the students was absolutely amazing. The smiles that you put on their faces it really just makes it all worth it in the end. Um, you can definitely see where all your hard work is going and why you're standing and I think it's really awesome to be able to put those two together in one big event. I got into Nighton as a freshman. Um, I participated with my sorority, Kappa Kappa Gamma, and I know when I went to the event, I didn't necessarily know what to expect, um, but I know when I left that I was changed and I knew that Nighton um, was something I needed to be a part of and was something I wanted in my life. This year, I've been lucky enough to visit Shans in the Arnold Palmer Children's Hospital. These visits have left an everlasting imprint on my heart and are a constant reminder that if the children can fight, then I can dance. Nithon has only been a part of my life for two years, but in that small amount of time, it's had a big impact on my life. It's been amazing to see what Nithon has accomplished in its past 17 years and how we can continue to save kids' lives. I've been involved with Nithon for the past four years, and I think the most amazing part about Nithon for me has been able to see the Miracle Children grow from where they were four years ago to where they are now. They're so happy and fun and healthy, and they're the complete life of the party and I can't imagine them any other way. Nithon inspires me to continue on to my career path. One day I hope to become a pediatric surgeon at Arnold Palmer Hospital. The reason why I joined Nithon was last year when I was on the morale team, I remember meeting one of the Miracle Children and we just started talking and it was so much fun and we were able to play on the inflatables and I loved it so much and I realized because of Nithon, this little girl was able to create those memories. My favorite part of this year definitely has to be the 50th birthday party that we threw for the Miracle families. And one of my favorite moments was when I was playing with all the kids, I was being a goofball, acting like my typical, typical five-year-old self, and I looked back at the parents, and a lot of them were just looking at us playing and smiling. And it was great to know that fundraisers and efforts such as Nightthon go to providing these families with such moments like that. I love Nightthon because what we do matters. Last year I was treated at Arnold Palmer Hospital and I can never express enough gratitude to all of you that donate and stand for kids like me. I love Nightthon because I love getting to see the Miracle Children's smiling faces and running around at Nightthon knowing that we help them get better just makes me smile and feel great. So I was on Morale last year and I met one of our Miracle Children and I just had such a connection with her and I felt like she kind of reminded me of my little brother and I couldn't imagine if my family had to go through what these families go through and I just think it makes this experience that much greater to have a personal connection. I got involved with my bond my freshman year being on morale and the first time I ever danced on stage I knew that I wanted more. So I was given the privilege of being on the executive board these past two years and it's been such an amazing experience. And it has, being a part of Nightthon has truly shaped the way that I view being a knight. And I will always and forever be for the kids. My most memorable Nightthon moment was when we toured the Arnold and Winnie Palmer hospitals. It was there that I saw a little tiny infant with a scar on his chest from an incision made during surgery. Throughout this whole experience, that's been the image that I've kept on my mind whenever I felt like I was overwhelmed or that the work I had to do for Nightthon was too much. But knowing that I'm helping save lives through the Children's Miracle Network um, made it worthwhile. A lot of people do Nightthon for different reasons, but I did it. Because in life, you don't get to choose what you fall in love with, it chooses you. And when I danced in Nightthon for the first time last year, and I stood for those 16 hours and saw the children that we saved, I knew that I'd fallen in love with something great. I dance because I want to raise awareness for the Children's Miracle Network. Every like, post, and tweet opens up the opportunity for somebody else to learn about the cause. With a campus of 60,000 students, we are limitless. I've been participating in Nightthon for four years, and I still can't put into words how life-changing this experience has been. As I look back at my time with UCF, I am forever grateful for the memories that I have made. Four years ago, I actually almost left Nightthon. Um, 
because I didn't think I was going to enjoy it. And I'm so glad I stayed because this has been the most meaningful and fulfilling experience of my life. Um, just to see how it's grown from something that people felt like they had to do to something that people actually want to do is the most amazing thing and I'm so glad to be a part of it. And I want to thank faculty and staff and um, UCF in general and my executive board for always believing in what we could do and um, how much potential we have if we all work together because it's a rough ride but look at what we've done this year and um, thank you and I hope you guys enjoy the next 18 hours. Here's to the crazy ones, the misfits, the rebels and the troublemakers, the round pegs and the square holes, the ones who see things differently. We're not fond of rules. And we have no respect for the status quo. You can quote us, disagree with us, glorify or vilify us. About the one thing you can't do is ignore us. Because we change things. We invent, we imagine, we heal. We explore, we create, we inspire, we make miracles. We push the human race forward. Maybe we have to be crazy. How else can we stare at an empty canvas and see a work of art? Or sit in silence and hear a song that's never been written. Or stand for 18 hours. While some see us as the crazy ones, we see genius. Because the people who are crazy enough to think they can change the world are the ones who do. Together we are potentially limitless.